Hello, Odoers, and welcome back. At Stealthy Wood, we work with a ton of suppliers to make sure we're getting the best products at the best prices. Sometimes one product has multiple suppliers, which can be tricky to keep track of. In Odoo, the vendor's price list stores product vendor's prices and deals, ensuring we correctly input prices on a request for quotation or RFQ. So let's dive into Odoo and see how we create and edit vendor price lists. We can configure a vendor price list from any Odoo app that includes the products tab. In the purchase app, I'll go to products in the menu and select products. And let's choose our cabinet with doors. On the product form, we're going to go to the purchase tab to see the vendor price list. Here we can see all of our vendors that supplies this product. Our first vendor, Wood Corner, lowered their price. So let's update the price to $100. It's important to note that order does matter on this list. The vendor at the top is selected by default when we use a reordering rule. We've selected Wood Corner as the default vendor because they give us the best price as long as we're willing to wait five days for them. The delivery lead time field tells us how long it takes for the product to arrive at the warehouse after confirming the purchase order. So if we're in a rush, we'll pay a little bit more and have our alternative vendor, ReadyMap, deliver us the stuff in two days. We can also configure a vendor discount on this page. To do that, I'll click Add a Line, and let's use WoodCorner as the vendor. WoodCorner offers us a bulk deal that gives us a 10% discount if we buy 10 or more cabinets. The quantity field defines the minimum amount of products for this special price to apply, so I'll set it to 10. We can do this in one of two ways. In the price field, we can input 90, which is the discounted price, or we can input the original price of $100. Then click on the slider icon in the far right, and we'll enable the discount field. In the new field, we can add the discount of 10%, and great. With either method, we'll have the cabinets at a super special price of $90 per unit. As you can see, it's pretty easy to add product vendors one at a time. But what should you do when you have a ton of vendors to add all at once? In that case, we can use Odoo's import feature to add multiple vendors at once. To do so, let's go to the Configuration button in the menu and select Vendor Price Lists. Here, we'll see a price list for all the products in our database. Now, let's download a template spreadsheet of vendors so you Odooers can see how you're supposed to format the column names when uploading your vendor price list. To do that, I'll click on the first three check boxes for the large cabinet, and then click the action button here at the top, and then export. We can choose Excel or CSV file formats. The fields to export on the right shows the columns that are expected to be exported in the file. After clicking the export button, we'll get a file that looks like this, and after entering the vendor info in this exact format. After entering the vendor info in this exact format, click the cog icon in the top left corner and select import records. Then I'll click on upload file and upload our vendor price lists. Since we see these fields here on the right, that means all the columns and info are formatted correctly. I just need to click on the import button now and we're done importing. Now let's see how all of that comes together by clicking new to create a new RFQ. Let's set the vendor to wood corner and add a product and choose our cabinet with doors. Depending on the delivery lead times we set on the vendor price list, the expected arrival date is updated too. As we can see in the unit price field here, the price is automatically set to $100 like what we set on the price list. Now check this out, I'll change the quantity to 10 and then we can see that the tax excluded subtotal field here on the far right is updated to 900. That's 10 multiplied by 90. The discount we configured is automatically applied. Isn't that cool? And there you have it. Vendor price lists make it easy to keep track of suppliers prices and discount specials. In the next video, we'll talk more, but see you next time, Odoers.